the rules. I, I will stay here, uh, and I will watch from the sidelines, uh, and I will just complain about our current president as a Democrat. <laughs> but keep politics out of it. We're here to play Smash. <laughs> so that we will have. Oh my god. And we're having a little bit of technical difficulties, having a webcam issue, but honestly, I, I'm i hoping it doesn't keep us from this bench because I'm ready to see these two play. It's... Yeah. Ready to see them break it down like they're Lucio. Like we <laughs> want to see some more crisp Smash 4 action here at Full Bloom 4. Cannot wait to tear it up. If you're enjoying what you're seeing so far, make sure you tweet it out with the hashtag FB4. Let people more know you want to see more of this and you want to make sure that it comes back next year. This event has been phenomenal. We've had 24 hour venue, we've had top quality commentators and casters behind the desk. Holding it down all weekend. A Yu-Gi-Oh tournament. Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> we had Crush and and uh, and Leffen playing Yu-Gi-Oh. We had uh, a werewolf after hours, and now we have Locust versus Cell in a game one on Smash Bell. Let's see what goes down. And off to uh, a, a pretty uh, spacing base start. Uh, neither neither player committing too hard, and they know that a single hit means a really extended string. Oh. Scared for a second. <laughs> I I know I know Ryu's a big meaty boy, not gonna go too far, but Bayonetta man, Bayonetta is just so scary. He's definitely one of the thick boys. Big fella sees him. But <laughs> hey, you know, it is coming to be that springtime. Time to to tone it down, get that six pack going. And Ryu definitely one of those people as well, so <laughs> ripping off the arms of his shirt and everything. Oh, Come on. God, you see that conversion from Locus Technology quick like 30-ish percent. Everything this guy hits, hits meaty. It's like a slab of just some fresh pork off the griddle. Oh no! Cells getting a quick one on Locust. You gotta be able to smash the eye those. That's the uh, only way to get out of there. But of course, being the big body that it is, Ryu can have some difficulty getting out of some of those conversions. Is it, is it gonna be up to? Oh, oh, oh. oh my God! City? Gosh. No, it will not, because we have ourselves the tried and true bread and butter up to to true shuriken to get rid of that first stock of cells. And then these two players uh, have showed up. I'm likely their first match of the day, so definitely their first match of the day. Showing that they ain't shook. They will, they're warm. Everything's gonna be fine. It's soup time. Yeah, probably a little bit groggy. Let's see what conversion we have there. That's a nice one. What? Duff him with the focus attack. Oh Hit him with a little bit of that downstairs action to the upstairs action with the sure you can. Locus. What goes down must come up, I guess. We're changing it around this time. Locus. Showing up. Yeah, you can probably hear me. He's probably saying Flambeezy, <laughs> shut the <laughs> hell up. Just kidding, Locus always plays with a headset on, so you probably can't hear me. But shutting me up real quick. <laughs> I like it. Always make a statement. Oh my god. Saying, I'm not gonna be the next upset on stream. I'll leave it to somebody else as we go to game two on Dreamland. But of course we are in top 32, so everything is a best of five. So Cells will have some time to try and adapt and see how he can kill Locus otherwise with this Dreamland counter. And I mean we're we're seeing he's he's playing well, he's he's got a game plan, but he's really gonna just have to keep from getting those uh, confirmable up tilts, right? And that's, that's a really hard thing to do. Bayonetta's got great tools, but Ryu, you need to A-hit to land that shirt. Mm -hmm. And that's that's something that's always on the table. Oh my goodness. Okay, man, she's getting some AB key double up there stream. He has Locust sweating on top of the platform. He's gonna burn that focus attack to get down. But Locust does have to be careful with that because multi-hit moves like Witch Twist will spell- What? we Oh what? no! He was just so caught up in how he's gonna punish it. It was such a clear and easy up smash for him, but he just didn't realize in time. Got a little shook, was too slow with the conversion, and Locust very ready to turn that around with a Shoryuken on the top platform. These two just dancing around each other with that invincibility. What is- uh... And there we go, down tilt, down tilt, strong down tilt into the Hadouken! Hadouken! Does it again. Making it so hard for Cells to just make it back on the stage. Oh my goodness, look at his edge pressure from Locust. Just holding it down with Ryu, the ordinary guy. Just, <laughs> man, okay. Almost has a conversion here. And another one, yeah, on Dreamland as well. You're not surviving that. He stands up, but this is best of five, so I think he's just taking off his, uh, his hoodie, it looks like. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Look on that hoodie, getting into it. Cells. 
trying to trying to just recollect after a, a quick 2-0 from, from Locust. But we saw it last set. It can happen. Those reverse 3-0s, they're, they're out here today. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if, if Locust can allow it to happen. Uh, but we're going to see if Salas has it in him. I, I'm very happy to see these players showing up regardless of if they're able to get the, the, the upset or not. They're yeah. showing that, you know, there's a lot of players out there that don't quite have the recognition but are very much so strong competitors in their own right. Yeah, yeah. Indiana. Indiana showing up. I'm actually so surprised that he didn't go for a punish on that focus attack to Ash Castle. He knows that, hey, if he goes for a focus attack, I can just go for the... Uh, the, the heel slide into yeah. the, the, the kick. Um, and you know, if he does the dash forward, I'll punish it. And if not, you know, the kick will pop me. But so far, it's not looking so good. He's being hit by this conversion off of the down tilt. And you get a little bit of something there. Looking for. Oh, a good DI on that. Almost got to him off the side. Jabs oh, him away. No. Can't get the witch twist in time. And now he's back down. Okay, he's struggling him a little bit. Nice, I like that use of the uh, bullet art up air falling down to catch the, uh, the air dodge from Locust. But, still, ooh, almost. Not quite able to kill him just yet, but that'll do it. I like the correction on the Choryuken, making sure to do it the other way and make sure it gets the fat, juicy hitbox with the true Choryuken. And sells on the last dot of his winner run. Hopefully he's able to at least take this stock here. Yes, he can rinse repeat this. There we go. Actually, what South hello hello? Oh no, I think he gets hit out of out of some hey, yeah, he is furious. Wrapping up his controller with the quickness. He's out of there. But don't count him out yet. He still has that loser's bracket run to make. I hope he hasn't let it damage his mentality a little bit too much. But good.